I mean, of course Rihanna was gonna be on my list. How the fuck was she not gonna be on my list? It's fucking Rihanna. From the sun-kissed, soaked shores of Barbados to the glittering global stages of pop superstardom, Rihanna has carved a path as luminous and indelible as the track she lays down. Bursting onto the scene in 2005, signing to Def Jam Records, she quickly transitioned from a fresh-faced island girl into a force majeure in the music industry. From there, Riri would go on to have such a dominant run, producing countless classic songs, while also leaving a stellar body of work. Rihanna has remained relevant for this long because of her amazing versatility. She never stuck in one genre like some of her other contemporaries who have tried but failed miserably to adapt to modern sounds and have reached a dead end of trying to recapture their past glories. She has such a brilliant way of like switching to genres and always coming off like so mad organic with it with ever coming off as try hard. With each album she showcased an uncanny ability to evolve setting trends rather than following them. When you know you know There's a reason why Lana Del Rey has had such a loyal cult following for the past decade. Best known as the queen of alternative, the storytelling ability that she has shown in her songs makes me feel easily transported to a place and moment that are only hers, where she's the protagonist of her story. Her music appeals to me in a way that is both personal and emotional, as it simply resonates with me so much. Not to mention her very sweet, soft, buttery voice is always like so moving to me, as it always feels like a spiritual experience every time I'm listening to her music. The way how Lana brilliantly and accurately tell stories from the perspective of a female is so beautiful especially for an artist like her who can be so unapologetically unfiltered and honest about her experiences looking at her remarkable body of work each album always feels like a different piece of her and carries a newfound sense of her self-awareness overall lana del rey is such a unique woman who has such a strong presence and aura that truly makes her such a gem touch my body Now, if you were to ask me who epitomizes what it means to be an R&B slash pop singer, it'd be none other than Mariah Carey. Throughout her storied career, which spans over three decades, Mariah Carey has done it all and has set the blueprint for so many artists that came after her, including the likes of Ariana Grande. Whenever there's a discussion of greatest vocalists of all time, Mariah Carey always has to be in that conversation, mainly due to her outstanding vocal agility, as she's able to hit like very high notes that not many others can pull off. When it comes to looking at Mariah's musical catalog, it's it's just truly unmatched from her 19 number one hits on the billboard hot 100 and even having a plethora of amazing albums such as daydream butterfly and the emancipation of mimi when it comes to legacy impact longevity and accomplishments mariah carey is undeniably one of the most important voices in the history of music Oh, I fucking love me some Sade. Her music is so soothing because it always gives me like a great feeling of bliss. She's definitely like my go-to artist whenever I'm in the mood of wanting to like, you know, feeling relaxed, feeling calm. Especially when it comes to listening to Love Deluxe, which is such a phenomenal album. Y'all should really go check it out. Known for her soulful and smooth vocals, Sade's unique sound combining elements of soul, jazz, and R&B instantly gained popularity and is the main reason why she was such a huge sensation throughout the 80s and 90s. With all of her accomplishments, the British Nigerian singer is an undeniable icon and a respected figure in the music industry. Die. 
For those who are longtime viewers on my channel, it really shouldn't be a surprise that Aaliyah was gonna be on my list. Serving as Missy Elliott and Timbaland's muse for their groundbreaking writing and production, as she helped shape the modern sound of R&B with her sweet, soulful voice. What made Aaliyah such a great role model is the way she showed ladies in the 90s that it's okay to be sexy even when it comes to wearing baggy clothes rather than just showing off your skin all the time. With this, she would inspire countless musicians following in her footsteps as they would follow the trend that made her famous. While her life was tragically cut short back in August of 2001 in a plane crash just at the age of 22, Baby Girl's legacy will forever live on through her music. Cause you all look the same, everyone knows your name, and that's your whole claim. Oh, Amy, sweet Amy, a once-in-a-generation talent who was taken from us too soon just at the young age of 27. Despite her tragically short-lived career, Amy Winehouse left an indelible mark on the music industry. Born and raised in London, she was a prodigy who found success with her expressive, raspy vocals that had a unique blend of jazz, soul, and R&B. With her distinctive style and delivery, Winehouse captured the attention of the music world, and with this, it made her an international sensation. Amy's talent was recognized with albums like Frank and would follow that up with with Back to Black, which featured some of her most memorable hits such as Rehab, earning her five Grammy nominations. While it is saddening that Amy's life came at a very tragic end due to alcohol poisoning in 2011, she'll forever be remembered as an icon, a voice for the marginalized, and a symbol of artistic brilliance. I will be right by your side if I can find the cure I I have been a fan of Gaga from as long as I can remember. She was like lightning in a bottle when she emerged with her hit single Just Dance and since then I have been a fan. I remember 8 or 9 year old me was like wondering to myself like who is this woman in these like crazy ass outfits? It's like it's so weird but yet I can't help but just be captivated by it. Because to me Gaga is like the equivalent of what happens when Madonna and David Bowie have a baby because she is just the total package. From her extravagant outfits, from her A-class live performances, especially with her amazing vocals, her songwriting, and her acting, like to me Gaga can just do no wrong. The reason for her fame and success is because she has so much imagination and creativity and that's what I love from artists is just you know being creative, being ambitious and you know and you know just finding Finding your own identity. Gaga was like a force to be reckoned with throughout her prime because she just constantly giving us hit after hit after hit after hit. From Poker Face, Bad Romance, Born This Way, Shallow, the list just goes on and on. She's not only proven herself to be a great musical artist, she's also proven herself to be a phenomenal actress. From being featured on the hit TV show American Horror Story, and most famously her role in the 2018 A Star Is Born remake, along with Bradley Cooper, which is hands down my absolute favorite romance movie of all time. She really changed the game for modern female artists in terms of bringing back the whole weird artsy factor that had been missing since the 80s and that particularly set a precedent for others to be more avant-garde especially in their aesthetics even with all the success in her career from a personality standpoint gaga is somebody who truly comes across very endearing and very wholesome because i don't think there's anybody and i literally mean anybody who can say a bad thing about her which to me speaks volumes and most importantly the one thing i've always admired about gaga is that she has always inspired me to just be myself it doesn't matter what you look like what you wear or where you came from always just be yourself and to not give a shit what others think of you and she always has inspired me to be that way but overall love lady gaga love 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 lady gaga uh, loving you is like a song i replay every three minutes and 30 seconds of every day and every chorus when it comes to discussion of rappers who can sing, it'd be blasphemous to not have Lauryn Hill in that conversation. L Boogie's duality as both a fierce MC and soulful singer is unparalleled, as she showcased this with finesse throughout her iconic studio album The Miseducation of Lauryn Hill on tracks like Do Up That Thing, X Factor, and To Zion. Lauryn's seamless fusion of rap and soul reshaped the landscape of 90s hip-hop and R&B. She carried the torch lit by pioneers that came before her, channeling the soul of Aretha Franklin in the the fire of Rakim, presenting a package so raw, so authentic, that it's still being celebrated as one of the genre's pinnacle achievements. Even with all her Grammy Awards and her accolades, Lauren's real triumph was her authenticity. She spat bars with conviction and sang with a passion that pierced the soul. While it is a shame that she quit when she was at the peak of her career, Lauren Hill set a high standard that many artists aspire to, and when it comes to mastering both singing and rapping simultaneously, none of them come close to El Boogie. Left a good job in the city Working for the And saving the best for last, the queen of rock and roll, the late great Tina Turner. 
Man, oh man, where do I even begin with Tina? From her iconic, raspy, soulful voice, to her daring fashion choices, her signature legs, and especially her electrifying stage presence, Tina Turner became a symbol of female empowerment and body positivity. Not only that, she also became a symbol of resilience, inspiring so many others to break free from toxic situations and reclaim their lives. On top of all that, her fusion of diverse musical styles of rock, soul, R&B, and pop was extraordinary as it blurred racial boundaries, paving the way for future artists to explore and celebrate their own cultural heritage. From Janis Joplin to Beyonce, Tina's impact can be heard in the voices of many who have followed in her footsteps. But most importantly, Tina Turner taught us how to fight back and how to reimagine ourselves at any age and to live life to the fullest like you have nothing left and that you can make it anywhere you go as long as you just keep pushing hard and apply yourself. Rest in peace, Tina. Thank you for all the great memories. You were, are, and will forever be simply the best.